welcome back to another YouTube video and you know these parts are full of chaos particularly this part um it just gets a little bit out of hand we're trying to throw a party a birthday party in fact and that should say enough when I try to throw an event in the sims it never really goes to plan if you'd like to catch up with the previous parts I have them linked for you down below but anyways let's get straight into this mess we could I suppose now just give our friends a little call how do I throw a party again throw a party that really shows how little parties I throw in The Sims. We threw a baby shower, didn't we, one time? At the very start of this Let's Play. Plan stay over. Oh, do you remember that? The stay over. Social event. So how do you plan a birthday party? I mean, not particularly a social event. It's just Dan's birthday. I just want a couple of people to come over so that they can give me birthday presents. Right, a birthday party. Thank you very much. Click to invite Sim. Oh wait, sorry, that's birthday Sim. Dan, a guest. Oh, Sydney. I mean, probably not Sydney. Oh, do you remember Conrad and Angelo? Let's just invite a lot of people. Oh, Rory can come. Oh, the neighbors can come. Um, What about our dad? Is that? No, no, we can't invite our dad. Obviously, our dad doesn't really want to be a part of our life, really. But that's fine. Why do I need to invite myself to the birthday party? I will be there. Oh, the Owens residence. Okay, why can that be at the front of the page? Excuse me. Okay, so we are having a birthday woohoo and I'm gonna I'm gonna pee myself so maybe let's just use the bathroom first before we go any further okay socialize with the birthday sim for three hours I mean yeah that is pretty easy considering it's our son let's compliment him you look great what are you wearing oh your suit okay never mind okay that's fine I was like why did you change your clothes why does everyone need to pee all of a sudden why does everyone need to pee <laughs> <laughs> At least Clement Frost is here. That's the main thing. Okay. Are you talking to the birthday sim? Have sims dance at the same time. Uh, we could do that if we get a stereo. Uh, where should I put it? Should I put it up there? All the way onto the bookshelf so no one can reach it. Maybe over here, actually. That probably seems like a good idea. I think this one is actually pretty cute. Okay, it doesn't seem to actually be able to go anywhere. So maybe I'll just put it here. Okay, let's put on some music. Easy listening. I mean, I don't know. I don't really care too much. And then why don't you continue talking to your child? Ask about day. Like, how is your day going? Oh, you change into your party wear? That duck t-shirt is your party wear? Okay, well, that isn't that just adorable. Okay, we are breaking down some moves over there. <laughs> Where is grandma? Grandma, could you return home? The sim can, cannot go home right now. Why can't you go home? I'm sure if you walk in here, we, you're allowed to go home. Danny, stop! Oh my God, no! <laughs> I wanted him to blow out the candles because we baked him a cake. Oh my god, why is the game the way it is? I'm gonna make him creative, I think. Wait, multi-skill? What is this? Sim wants to be the life of the party. Sim loves to seek active play with friends. Sim wants to build their creativity and mental skills. Or Sim wants to master both their mind and their body. That's so cute. Okay, I think maybe more of the mental skill for him, to be honest with you. Did I just make him... I mean, he loved to sleep, so we could make him lazy. I think that's pretty funny. But then again, though, Dan was through it all because he was the first infant that we had in this Growing Together Let's Play. So I feel like he like he would be a bit hot-headed. I'm going to give him the hot-headed trait. This is my old friend, Molly. Why don't we dance together? Is that is that something we can do? Wait, did I not just see? Invite Molly to dance, please. Yes, okay, so we've got two Sims dancing at once. Grandma, get in here. Grandma, dance together. Uh, Beastie Boogie, yes. Beastie Boogie, you can let go of the dog now. The dog is okay. Are you dancing? Okay, there is three people dancing at once. I don't get it. Can you dance with us as well? Invite Lou to dance. Oh, he's gonna pee himself. Okay, you, you get up, Clement. Dance with us. Okay, perfect. Now, make a group meal. Jesus Christ, the amount of meals I've cooked today. God, there's so many people at my house. Why am I so nervous? Cook a grand meal of tofurkey, please. Now, play a game with the birthday sim. Oh, wait, we never even looked at him. Oh my God. First of all, happy birthday. Second of all, you kind of look like a sneaky alien. For some reason, you're giving me like Sims 2 vibes. Pretty creepy. Uh, cute little shoes you got there. Compliment the birthday sim. Uh, I'm sure one of us could do that. Wait, could you like, could you dance with us? Could you go here? Dance. 
Oh my god, I forgot that Molly is just standing outside on her own. Oh my god. I forgot about Sarah. Do you remember her? Oh my god, I never invited her to the party. Do I even know her still? Oh, that's so sad. I never invited her to the birthday. Oh lord above. Hey there, neighbor. Do I hear a sizzle of something broken in there? Um, no, I don't think so. Who, who are you? Oh, wait, maybe that is broken, but I don't really care that much. Okay, grandma, can you please compliment the birthday sim? Okay, like, where do I find compliment now in all of this? Affection. Bump. Family kiss. No. Um, it's so hard to find things. Maybe small talk. Is that a compliment thing? No. Compliments. Oh my god, obviously it's compliments. Congratulate. Okay. Is that gonna is that gonna count? Compliment the birthday sim. I really don't think that counted. That doesn't really make me feel very happy. Who is taking a bath? Guest. Okay, one of our guests is casually just taking a bath. What is going on? This party is kind of getting out of hand. Grandma, I need you to take a feral poop. I need someone, I need one of you to start complimenting the birthday sim because he's gonna go insane. Criticize lack of motor growth. Okay, well, that's rude. Let's not do that on his birthday. Friendly compliments. Congratulate. Can you please stop talking to the neighbors and congratulate your child? Congratulate him. Congratulations on growing up. Instead of saying happy birthday, you can always say that. How do I compliment the birthday sim? It just is not working. No, that's not working. I don't really... Heartfelt compliment? Is that is that gonna work? Okay, that worked. Can we do that again? Can I please heartfelt compliment you again? Activities, affection, complaints. See, I don't know how to do that. Okay, grandma, your turn. Heartfelt compliment? Probably can't. What about you? Where are you gone? You're gone upstairs. Great. You know, it's really impossible to find things in this menu. You. I know I keep going on about it, but it's just so annoying. Like, I can't find compliment. It usually is here. Compliment. No. This party is literally so bad because, first of all, we can't even blow out the candles because he just aged up. So the candles are just there. We can't eat the cake because someone has to blow out the candles. Oh, no, wait, wait. I suppose we could remove the candles. Okay, well, I think, guys, this birthday party is a failure. Maybe we should just stop focusing on it and just make sure that our sims don't die because I feel a bit bad. Everyone is a little bit scattered around the house and it makes me feel slightly nervous. Why don't you talk to Clement Frost? Talk to Stranger. That's funny. Talk to Clement. Clement is practically your uncle. Okay, Da, you're still dancing. I mean, it is your party, so you can do whatever you want to. You can start cleaning up. Would you invite people to cake? I guess you could give Molly a bit of attention because I know it is Dan's birthday, but poor Molly is going to be the next heir and we're giving her no attention. She was outside for like the whole day long. Poor thing. Are you are you giving your daughter attention? So annoying. Friendly. Um, How do I play? Can you play with your child? Yay. Okay, they're playing. At least that. So she's going to get a little bit of attention. Then, yeah. I mean, I don't know. The party is a little bit crazy. And that's what we like to see. We like to see this. It's nice, though, that... Okay. <laughs> Birthday party unsuccessful. Yay. <laughs> I love how it made me feel so like, yay, you accomplished this. It's super unsuccessful, but you did it. <laughs> so we get no reward or anything. Well, look, at least we did it. At least he had a party. But like, I was just about to say, like, look how cute this is, is that we actually have a big enough house to be able to have a party like this. Isn't that so cute? I'm pretty proud of us for getting this far. Um, Oh my God, I'm in her brain. I'm pretty proud of us for getting so far in this Let's Play. I really didn't expect us to, you know, get to this point in the game where we literally have like a bunch of people at our house and that guy staring at me like, stop taking pictures of me. It's not my good hair day. And her, like she just got some crazy texts. She's like, oh my God, you you did what? You know, I'm just really, really happy. Um, The only thing I'm unhappy about is this person having a full a bath spa experience in my bathroom downstairs as the party is going but everything else i'm pretty i'm pretty happy with dan spent the whole birthday party dancing which i mean fair play to him that's what i like to do with parties as well i love a good dance he is so cute i'm so happy now we have no time it is nine o'clock thank god the man has gone from the bath jesus that was awkward okay what we need to do now is we need to clean up this mess because we've got a wedding tomorrow and i don't really know what we're gonna do to be honest with you but maybe i should plan something for the backyard 
Like, I mean, we could get married in like the park or something, but why don't we just put everything into the shed? Because that is what we would normally do in real life. Okay, I've put on the move objects key so I can hide all of the stuff from the back garden in here, which is obviously, it's like a very normal thing to do, I suppose. You know, just hiding all the stuff as you do. Okay, we could probably move the chairs over a little bit, maybe to like this corner. Corner. I mean, well, I guess it would be nice to get married in that corner. So maybe we can move the planter boxes somewhere. Right, so we should probably get a nice wedding arch. I want it to feel quite like makeshift, kind of at home situation. So like the idea of it being quite craftsy is kind of cute. So maybe we could get this one. Okay, the light. Let's get this one. Let's move the plant over a little bit as you do. I think that's pretty cute. Right in front of that little gazebo. Adorable. Then we need some chairs, I suppose, just so people can watch, I guess. I don't know. I've never planned a wedding like this. So this is fairly new to me. I never do weddings in this game and I should. I think it would be nice if I did some weddings in The Sims, you know, really celebrate my Sims lives, but I don't. So let's just not think about it too much. Maybe if I move the these chairs over a little bit so like that will be our aisle in the middle kind of like this I mean we don't really need that many chairs I feel like no one's actually going to sit down so we shouldn't even worry about the chairs but you know it would be nice to have something you know going on for us so maybe like a small little scenario like this I need the aisle so I need a small aisle can I not make it nicer is that Kind of like that, cutesy. I'm gonna have to put that chair into the rock a little bit, but that doesn't matter. Uh, can I change the color to white? Oh, that's actually pretty cute for a little home wedding. I think that's pretty cute. Yeah, and then we can have the little board somewhere, like maybe here. Oh, guys, I think that we are getting somewhere with this that's so cute okay i actually really like this um it's not too bad it's not too shabby you can maybe put like these flowers there and then maybe you can have maybe some flowers actually back there would be quite cute oh guys are we gonna do a cute little barbecue oh wow okay i think we've got this sorted okay i think that's everything so let's go back into the game and i need a maid of honor and honestly i don't really have i mean i had the great opportunity to ask all the guests that were just at my house but i forgot so why don't i ask them like first thing tomorrow morning is that possible i don't know we don't even have a wedding cake this is really rushed plan a wedding event can we do it like right now like let's talk so wedding ceremony rehearsal dinner no family gathering bachelor red party engagement party oh my god we had none of those okay let's just do the event bride and groom obviously sims of honor yeah i didn't invite anyone i didn't ask anyone to be my officiant forgot the flower pals i mean grandma can be the officiant molly can you be the flower girl <laughs> molly you'll be you'll be okay <laughs> how do i ask my child to be flower girl i don't think she can i don't think a toddler can be but i guess you could be you could be the ring bear for sure How, can she not be the flower petal girl that's kind of sad i mean isn't it usually small children like little toddlers being flower girls at a wedding i don't know he's gone up the stairs so that just takes my ideas out the window i want to ask you something did i am i already after asking her are you my officiant you are where, where are you going you're going downstairs to talk to your mom in here okay fab in the shed very suspicious ask to be ring bearer hey son happy birthday can you be my ring bearer tomorrow i know it's a very late planned event you know we're just playing it at 11 o'clock at night but that's pretty normal can you be my ring bearer he's like yeah i got a few plans tomorrow but i feel like i can move things around how oh, interesting melody really enjoyed hearing dan talk about his interests uh would say that melody likes discussing interests yeah sure i mean this is not about you right now this is about dan being our flower petal no sorry our ring bear did he say yes or no i don't even know yeah i mean i don't really know i also don't really know how to get the cake i really don't know how to order a cake <laughs> how do i order a cake what is this um i mean it surely is through the phone do i really have to google how to get sims wedding cake how to order sims for a wedding cake <laughs> You can order them via the computer. Okay, how? Can I just say order? Purchase wedding cake. Oh my God, thank God. Okay, brilliant. Okay, let's go for a schnazzy one. Floral wedding cake. Maybe the floral one. I mean, that would work really. 10 hours until expired. What is this? Okay, I have 10 hours. Oh my God. Can I put it into the fridge? I can. 
if someone eats my cake, I swear to God, there will be a slight murder. Okay, so we've got a cake. We just need to ask tomorrow morning for someone to be our... Well, I guess we don't really need a bride of honor. I mean, it's a bride of honor, a maid of honor. I guess it's kind of fine. So why don't we actually all just go to bed because it is pretty late at night. Let's sleep because tomorrow is the big day, everyone. Oh wait, should we plan it now? Guys, thank you so much for watching today's episode and not to spoil anything, but the next part is actually really, really funny. I had so much fun recording this next episode. So definitely stay tuned and subscribe so you won't miss it. And if you want a good laugh, definitely come back for the next part. Thank you so much for watching and I shall see you in the next video. Bye. Bye.